Hey guys, it's Papa Steve on the move. A neck warmer or neck gaiter is generally known as a buff, named after the popular brand. This is a multi-use garment that is handy to wear in all four seasons. There's a number of ways to use it and we'll look at several right now. So last week I posted some info on layering to stay warm. It was well received, but a few of you pointed out that one key piece of information was missing, a buff. It's true that I neglected to include that, despite the fact that I use one all the time. Now one viewer even recommended the Patagonia Capoline Air Gator, which I tried to get, but it appears to be sold out. I'll keep trying to check back on this one because I'm a fan of the brand. Now the Buff brand comes in both a wool and a synthetic material. There's different sizes and prints to suit your personal style. Buff has plenty of content out there to show you how to use this, so I won't get into all the different ways to use it, but I will share how I typically use my Buff in both the cold and the warm weather. So in winter, like right now, I usually use this as a neck gaiter. It, uh, I stopped wearing a scarf when I got this thing because frankly, it's so light so long you can use it for several different ways and it's light enough to you know put in your pocket or to wrap around your wrist when you're not using it so right over the head makes an excellent scarf or a hood you can get it up cover your neck and your back of your head save a lot of heat and it even acts as a balaclava if you pull the bottom back up and over you can get it over your nose and mouth. Very versatile. Now, I usually wear a beanie and the neck gaiter while I'm running out in this weather, but the buff itself makes an excellent cap. If you twist it and fold it over itself, so that it's got that little bit of twist on the top, closes it up, you can use it as a cap pretty handy. Now in the summer, it's a little bit different usage. It's pretty hot, but the light merino wool is great. So you can fold this thing up carefully and it can be used as a headband. Or in the winter, you might pull it over your ears and use it as earmuffs. Also makes a great hair tie, you know, for those of you with long hair. I also use it as a uh, neck guard underneath my ball cap. I can put this thing on, flip it around the back. Keeps you nice and warm, keeps the sun off the back of your neck, lets me use a lot less sunscreen, and I'll even wet it down to stay cool. Uh, one more great utility use for the buff is you can use it as a face mask. Now it's not quite a medically uh, regulated covering but you know when you pull it up you can double it up and it's great for those awkward moments when you're required to use a face covering somewhere and you forgot to bring a mask like when you're grabbing a coffee after a run so that's how i use my buff it really is a great addition to your backpacking gear or your day pack if you guys have any other gear i should check out leave a comment below or send me an email. You can also comment on my social media at the links down below too. And thanks again to those subscribers who are sending me this great information. I really appreciate your support. Now February is coming fast. We have a few more months of winter here in Canada, so planning another trip to Banff soon. So another hotel review and a visit to Mount Norquay Tube Park. Man, I can't wait for spring to get back out camping. I'll see you guys on the trail. Pop Steve on the move.